discovered. Hello everyone and welcome to this banter blitz in English. It's in been a while since uh, since I did uh, my last one. I am French Grandmaster Laurent Fressinet. I am uh, the second of Magnus Carlsen for all his World Championship matches. And uh, if you are a premium member, you will be able to uh, challenge me. Hey, everyone in the chat. Uh, I hope uh, life is great. You have to challenge Zlatan 56. And it will be completely random, of course, on a premium member. Uh, may uh, challenge. I will take the first challenge. So uh, it's in French, but aléatoire means random. And hi everyone in the chat. Uh, I will mainly uh, read, if not only, the chess 24 chat. I uh, hide hi crypto mochilo and Yuko Dub 1972. So random challenge. No, it doesn't work. I should abort that one first. Uh, yeah. Hopla. No. So, random That's challenge. One. And now, Casper, I'm losing all the time to Casper, just to try. Um, so, here we go against Crypto, a German friend, and I will go with 1d4. So, you may challenge me in 3 minutes, 5 minutes, 3 plus 2, whatever. Uh, it will be a 2 hours banter blitz, and uh, probably at the end, if there's a lot of challenges, I will uh, play some bullet games, uh, which are fun, and where I am uh, quite bad. So you have a chance to, to win against me. Uh, which are fun. Uh, if you are good at bullets, then it's am, trouble for me. Uh, Quite bad. So you have a chance to, to win against me. So Knight BD2, the Tory uh, attack, which bullets, looks very similar to the, to the London system. Uh, I will just play Bishop H4. And, uh, well, it's a very slow system, but uh, all pieces on the board, and it could be quite quite tricky for, for Black uh, to deal with that. Eco! We have Eco! Really? Jordan Duboff! Haha! Uh, I hope not! Eco! Eco here as well. Oh boy! I know why! I'm really sorry about that. I didn't switch off the the YouTube stuff. This is tech fresh, you know. So tech fresh is me, um, and sometimes I do some stupid mistakes. Uh, uh, I do less and less these days, but still, it it can happen. So now it's good. Is it good now? I'm I'm really sorry about that. So a six. This is a bit slow. So I can I can go g four. Uh, or I can go knight e5. Knight e5 is very, very typical. I should play a bit faster uh, because, okay, Crypto probably is playing um, all the time against uh, Jan. And Jan is uh, pretty good at uh, flagging. So, probably, uh, I guess, German people on this side, they just think flagging is okay, which actually it is. I will probably flag. Uh, I hope I will flag a few of you during this session. So uh, I think d4 was very good actually. I missed it, but now, yeah, now I'm I'm happy because I managed to to stabilize uh, my knight. I have a nice knight here, and I will pre-move here, and I will get some mating attack. I guess He has to take, uh, otherwise it doesn't make much sense. If he's going knight c5, I would just play b4 and queen d3. So you, you, you see your challenge is coming in. Uh, I will play b4, and after knight a4, I will just go queen, a, queen d3. I think g6 has to be played, but I have knight takes e6, some simple trick. And now I will win the exchange. If he takes here, I just take here, check, and mate. This game over, basically. Yeah, he has to play queen b6. I will just take here. Uh, probably play bishop f2 and reroute my bishop on on d4. Uh, it's a beautiful square for my my bishop. Look at that knight. I don't even need to mate now. I could go, of course, uh, for the attack, but uh, who cares? When you have uh, exchange and and pawn up, you don't need you don't need to attack. You just need to to play it uh, safe, exchange some pieces, win the end game. Jordan Dubov, that's a nice uh, uh, nickname. So, of course, that was my uh, 
Um, my two colleagues, uh, Dubov was in the team, in Magnus team in uh, 2018 for the match against Kawana, while uh, Jordan joined uh, this year. It was, it was, of course, a nice addition. Uh, Jordan van Forest uh, for the match against uh, Nepo. And, of course, if you want to, if you're a player member, not only you can play Banter Blitz against uh, Top Grandmasters, but you may also watch the new video series about uh, about the inside of uh, Team Magnus and I with my dear friends Jan Gustafsson and Peter Heine Nielsen. And uh, we we make a recap, uh, basically, of, uh, of the match close to 10 hours of, uh, of video series, so you may enjoy that. And maybe on Wednesday, we have a surprise for you. That will be on a, on a different format, but some podcast, Chicken Chess Club. Uh, we are members, but now we are official members for, uh, for now uh, some time. So we'll have this podcast with, again, Peter and... Um, and Jan, so we'll discuss, uh, we'll discuss, of course, uh, chess news. Uh, basically, the first episode will be on Wednesday. Hey, Paul Beitner, I will play the London system. Pity the fool with the French corporate. Mochilo, Laura, I'm ready to play with you. But you have to be a premium member, brother. And you are lucky. Why? Because there is a there is a promo code take first forty. It's for me forty percent discount. And not only you have a you have an immediate game. If you become premium member now, you have a game immediately, and also you have access to all the video series in every languages. Did you discuss the Anish Giri hack? Jordan Duboff is asking, Haha, you will have to listen to the podcast to know about that. Uh, let's see, maybe. We did discuss Fide politics, which is a uh, favorite topic of uh, Peter, obviously. Hey, Florent Herb. So don't hesitate to, to ask questions in the chat. I um, will happily uh, answer all your questions here. Pity the Fool just gave me a pawn, uh, which is, of course, um, bad news for him, e5, but he's not even threatening to take because the bishop is hanging, so I will just play bishop d3. Eyeing here. Maybe I can come uh, to h5 with my queen uh, a bit later, so that's, uh, that's kind of good. Everything is working, yeah. ED, but now I just take here, my friend. Ay, 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 ay. This is game over. Pity the fool. Such a pity. Such a pity for you. Yeah, we already play. On I, 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 I also make um, a banter blitz every Wednesday at uh, 8.30. Um, 8.13. This is the usual time. Um, but... This week it will be 6.30, ah, the hook is hanging now, 6.30 because we have uh, in France a uh, presidential election and there is, um, and there is uh, a Macron-Le Pen debate at 9 uh, p.m. So I prefer to move the time of my uh, banter. And of course, I will speak in French. So if you don't speak French, you won't probably understand much. But you may challenge me. You may come and challenge me. That's for everyone. Okay, so bishop b6. I want to mate uh, as soon as possible. Of course, I could take here. Oh, that was not a good move. Thank you. Thank you, uh, Pity the Fool. I will take some random challenge. Nico Dub, again, a French guy. Ah, Jordan Duboff. No, I see why Laurent kept beating Jordan in Blitz. That's not true, actually. But, yeah. I Jordan is better than me, but uh, it's close. I feel it's close against Jordan. Okay, I will play against Nico Dub. Ah, 
my Budapest Gambit. I love this line. I will go 94. Only I play for tricks here. I will go 96. I just want to to um, to give a pawn. That part I managed to speed up my development. So knight f3, knight c6. And now, now, knight bd2 is a good move. I will just sign knight c5. Let's, let's see. And then I will play d6 anyway. Um, I'm freestyling here a bit. Should I go d6? Oh, almost h5. Okay, let's have fun. Let's go h5. That's a bit of a nonsense what I'm doing, but yeah, who cares? It's a five minutes blitz, so so. Um, you also uh, you cannot play, you cannot bank all your hopes on 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 the clock. Allez. Yes, bishop g5 here, which I missed. Uh, maybe I have knight takes b3 and bishop b4 check. Wow, that could be nice. So bishop g5, knight takes b3, and if bishop d8, I have bishop b4 check. Okay, let's go for it. I hope he missed it. Oh, fun. Nico Dub. So now I go bishop b4 check, and he lost a few tempi, and I'm doing incredibly well suddenly. I will just take on g3. I'm taking on g3, small intermezzo. He has to take like this way. I will just play queen e7, for instance, and I'm doing very, very well. I will get back that pawn, and his pawn structure is a disaster. I need double pawn, so I will take back that pawn and uh, get a very comfortable position. So bishop c3, should I take here first? I can do whatever I want. Of course, after 95, I will have to take here. Oh, bishop g2, that was not seen, but <laughs> knight g4 is so tempting. So I will go knight g4. If he takes here, I just take back here. Ah, Khrushchev is here. <laughs> Khrushchev, you have to talk in, in uh, English in the chat. This is not... Uh... Not good what you are doing. You have to share your uh, your great sense of humor with uh, with the uh, with the English community. Yeah, maybe it was not too clever actually to allow that. My my knight is hanging now. If I go knight e three, we just take on g seven. I can take here. Okay, it's too tempting to go knight e three, so I cannot help it. Uh huh, and maybe ah uh, my rook will be hanging. It's too complicated. Queen g7, knight takes g2, king f2, queen e3, or bishop c5 maybe. King takes g2, queen e2, king g1, and I don't see a win for me because my rook is hanging. So maybe I will have to play rook f8 after queen takes g7. But this knight is a monster, so he has king f2 maybe. I don't know. It's a very sharp position. <laughs> Teach us some basic French, s'il vous plaît, unorthodox. Bonjour, comment ça va? Baguette. Yann thinks it's very funny. Baguette, pain blanc. When he's talking about, he's making this baguette pain blanc. Jokes, he thinks it's he's incredibly funny. Ah, wow, Nico Doub. Ah, Queen F2, I, ah, so I have to play Knight C2. Aha, uh -huh, that was a good move, actually. Wow. So it's not so clear now. He has to take here, I have to take here. That's such a mess. Maybe bishop d6 is a funny looking move, but... Yeah, bishop d6 is a good move, maybe. Huh? I'm simply worse after all that. Uh, so we'll take here, maybe hide with the king. How, how do I get out here? EF. Okay, now I have to go here to protect my pawn. I'm massively worse here. I have to go A6, maybe or B8, B5, something like that. But yeah, I don't like what I'm 
what I'm experiencing here. I will just go B8 and B5. Okay, one, where should I go? Maybe here. It's not funny, at least this pawn is hanging, so that's a good news for me. Uh, but it's... Uh, I overdid it, maybe, huh? Uh, B5, now probably Bishop D5 is a good move, though I can take, and B2 will be hanging. So I don't know. Have you beaten Magnus in a training game last year? Um, I don't think we played, actually. Now Magnus is playing with mainly with Daniel Dubov and some with uh, Jordan. Jordan van Forest is playing training game with uh, Magnus, but this is only about uh, getting a boost of confidence for, for Magnus. So, yeah, that's how it works. Now we'll take that pawn with check, which is nice. Always, it's, it's usually quite a good news, yeah? To lol, don't lol. It's two. It's absolutely true. Playing with Jordan is only for confidence. It's not uh, real training. Uh, I will go f6, even if it looks a bit lousy. I want bishop b7, rook d1. Can I go bishop b7? But I will probably lose that pawn. Does it matter? I don't know. Let me go king c7, rook d3 is annoying. Um, yeah, so I should go here. It's not great, but, uh, yeah. I will just give a check. Maybe play f5, but that will be a pawn up, but maybe it's a draw. Uh, but, yeah, I, probably I cannot do much more than that. So let's go here. I will have rook g6 at the end, yeah? What did I do? I will go here. Oof, I'm not sure this is good. This is probably way too risky what I'm doing, but okay, he has no time. Oof. Should I go king e8, h6, f rook b1, h7, check, and f2. Okay, I will go. I will do that. And gamble. Mm, check. How do I... Now I should uh, just flag him. That's weird. That's a weird way to do it. Um, I want to bring my king, but he has OK for now. OK. OK. Okay. Uh, that will be a draw. Okay, that's a draw. Ah, GG. GG. He's playing, yeah? Okay. And let's play. GG Nico Dub. That was a good game. Okay, first though. That's not good. Shadow Mate. We already played. Yeah, he played well. Played well. That was an interesting game. So he plays uh, the hat. The rat. Just for fun, I should uh step up my, my rating uh, here. At least uh even, of course, on the previous play zone, on the old play zone, as we call it, I had like uh, more than 3,000, but uh, here I'm struggling. It's tough. People are massively underrated. So, this is f6, and now after f3, you just go knight g5. I played that line a bunch of times, so now I know uh, some kind of theory, let's say. I never are so crucial of 
is now saying that my accent yeah we know we know Mochiro that the accent reminds you of uh, Jack Clouseau the inspector from the Pink Panther but okay you, you already told me that when I was uh, commentating the World Cup many many times every day was the same story I'm really sorry I don't do it on purpose uh yeah so th thank you uh Kluchiov. i don't know such a flow yeah my accent i mean it's very it's, it's not easy it's not easy uh to to get rid of it to to be honest sometimes i'm trying but uh, then i'm uh uh <laughs> it's coming back um it's coming back uh very quickly simply Okay, bishop g7, then I take on e5. The only thing which makes me happier when I'm uh, uh, <laughs> uh, listening to someone uh, with a strong accent, it's when I'm listening to, to Etienne Bacro. Uh, because, uh, well, then I feel like my accent is quite decent uh, compared to, to his. Um, but uh, yeah, that's about it actually. So now I'm already doing very, very well. Uh, the pawn e5 is hanging. I will, I will just short castle. If knight f3, I will just go bishop g4, I guess. Uh, did I just promise that? Yeah, okay, let's go bishop g4. I just want to castle. I hope to collect on, on e5 at some point. I can go queen d7 and on castle actually as well. I would, but we're already at that game now with uh, shadow mate. No, it was 96 now. 96, I just take here and uh, it's game over. Jordan Dubov, who says, which was your favorite camp? Camp, Lithuania, Spain or Thailand? But Jordan, tell me, uh, tell me, Jordan Dubov, tell me who you are. And then we can talk. But this is exactly the same game that we played, Shadow Mate. Come on. Behave yourself. How, how do you know so? Do, how do you have uh, so many informations, uh, Jordan Dubov? Um, I enjoyed uh, Lithuania was cap because the weather was cap. I was sick. I came with, uh, which with it was called later on the French flu. Um, actually, Magnus didn't show up uh, because of my flu because then uh, I was sick the first few days. I didn't isolate. I was not asked to, to do so. And then uh, everyone uh, was sick so <laughs> the, during the world camp. Uh, so that was not good. Oh, we play exactly the same game, but this is this is just sick, actually. What is he doing? This is just so funny. I just take here. I think this is our game. And uh, so everyone was sick. Magnus didn't show up because we were sick. And he didn't want to get sick, which is quite understandable. Spain was great. We were so welcome. Um, but it was amazing. Thank you, Shadow Mate. But I think we already played the same game uh, last week. So you have to uh, you have to do something else. O only one, please. Uh, I, I want to play against everyone. So please only uh, issue one challenge. Let me have a look. Quick look if there's some uh, cheaters here. Or not, if people are issuing, uh, uh, oh, two changes, only one, please. So the randomness is still there. Oops, Kitty, five minutes game, let's go. So in Spain, uh, Andalusia was brilliant, and uh, Thailand was as well brilliant, of course. Uh, it's different, yeah, during the match, because in Thailand uh, we were during the match and right before the match, so this is where um, there's a lot of stress, obviously. At the start of, of the match, of course, it was, it was not easy because uh, Magnus was, uh, I mean, the match was rather equal, the first five games, and then, um, and then uh, Magnus won this... Uh, well, this brilliant game six, uh, this hi historic uh, game six, simply. Uh, there is, it was just, uh, it's 
turning point, of course. And then it was very enjoyable. Uh, because, you know, uh, he's leading, he's confident, he's playing well. We feel our prep is holding, at least uh, uh, as black. You're plus one, so you don't need to to win games. I mean, like, it's better, of course, to win games, but uh, it's your opponent who has to, has to come back. So as white, it bit, becomes a bit easier, in a way. Of course, when you are plus one, everything becomes a bit easier, because even if you lose a game, it's no disaster. So, a uh, qu question from Kamnik student. Hi, Lohan. Any plans for making a chessable course? Yes, Kamnik student. Yes. I will do a chessable course about what? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. But I will do one. Uh, end game, end game, end game, end game. Should I go for the end game? Can I go the, that way to the end game? I will take here. Maybe it's not great. Last part of the match was relaxed and fun. <laughs> You're done saying. No. Ah, yes. But uh, we are still working. I mean, <laughs> no, but you know, you are where you are. Let's say before the last game as black. So we were ready in the, the anti martial, uh, obviously. And, and um, you expect a surprise, actually, because you don't expect Nepo to, to repeat. But you have no clue uh, which surprise it will be. So you, we just checked, of course, the English he played the, the previous game, uh, the anti martial again. But uh, then you have your repertoire ready. So actually, there is uh, not... Uh, there is some work, but it's not overloaded, let's say. Not like at the at the start of a few days. few days before the, the match, ah, you start to... You are never you never worked enough. I mean, like, there's always something missing. And uh, uh, you feel ready, but you feel you could do... You can always do more. Uh, that's the point. Spanish speakers community. Yeah, uh, Yares says, I cannot challenge you. I'm really sorry about that. Um, are you sure? You know how to challenge, yeah? Yares, Mayum Fatima, no. Only one, please. Uh, Yares, Yares, you are here. You can challenge me. You want two plus one or three minutes? You have four challenges, Yares. Not one, four. So I will delete a few of them. Tell me which one you want left. Of course, Spanish speakers community is also important on Chess24 platform. Of course, yes. Every community is very welcome. And that's why in my banter blitz every Wednesday in French, you just can issue a challenge, do your stuff if you don't understand French. And I will play against you. I don't play only against French. I, I do it randomly, like, like tonight. So please, join us. I will just go rook d4. Why? Because I attack. The hook, and I attack the pawn. Three plus two. Okay. Mayum Fatima, she has two. I'm, I'm like police, you know? Checking if everybody is playing fair. Of course, everybody is playing fair, but it's a bit confusing. We should manage to, to have only uh, one challenge one challenge from, from the same person. So now it's okay. Yes, you have the same odds than other people to play a, a Blitz game. And... um. If I didn't play against everyone, so if you play the game, please don't challenge again. Um, but if you didn't have time to challenge me, I will play some bullet and uh, most likely everyone will have a chance to play. So no worries. Should I go KC1? What should I do? I should prevent any kind of counterplay. Um, it's not too easy. Actually, I will just go here. And now, should I go bishop d5? Maybe. Ah, no, bishop d5 you can take. And go c2. Maybe bishop e4. Ah, yes, some. Ah, bishop d1. It's a bit lousy to play like that, but I want bishop b3. No, I don't I, I don't do that. So, yeah, orthodox. Please take the all challenges first, if possible. I do random, because then... 
I don't want. Uh, uh, you know, I played so many banter blitzes that I know it's a topic in the chat. Please play against me. Please, 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 please. And of course, everybody wants to play. So this random challenges is great because you don't decide anymore. So that's what I'm doing. I'm sorry. Yes, some plays though. Maybe bishop g3 and rook c1, but he will, he will have knight c5, which is annoying. So let me take here and play b3. And uh, stay passive, but stay with pawns. All right, we, we, we love pawns here. Um, and yeah, I can play e4 next, bishop p3, maybe f3. Or maybe g4, take some space. This is that is true, Nobias. That's true, unorthodox. But yeah, then uh, then some people I know they, they challenge one hour before the the show starts, and they leave. And uh, yeah, so it's always uh, not nice for for others. So I guess you are um, you are very organized, unorthodox, <laughs> and you want you want this to. Um, how to say? I mean, just uh, simply to 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 change your to change me before before the show starts. You will think about it. That's what I mean. I go c one. I want rook c seven. If bishop c five, I just go rook c three. Maybe h five. Only premium can make jokes. Yeah. Yeah, chessable course. I have to discuss with uh, people from chessable, which I. Uh, the discussion is uh, supposed to happen uh, already some time ago, but it will. It will happen and something will happen. Most likely. I want it mate, so I can go rook c6 now, attacking that pawn and that pawn. I can go h5 and play for mate. Uh -huh. Let's play for mate. Let's be a man here. Um... Why Magnus is not playing the Grand Chess Tour? He's busy playing Champion Chess Tour. What can I say? He likes this uh, online uh, tournaments, which are played on Chess24. And the next one is starting Thursday, I think. I'm pretty sure it's uh, Thursday. It will be eight, uh, 6. 6, uh, 6 p.m. as always, and you will have it's a special one. It's a major. So you have eight people in the same location, which is Oslo. And it's like eSports. So they are playing in the same room, but uh, they have computers and they play uh, in front of each other, but in front of a, uh, of a screen. Thank you, Oopskitty. And let's go for the next game against Y. Must lose to this box. 9-1 I have against him. Let's go E4. Make some middle game course like John and understanding middle games. He's telling me Kramnik student. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, I don't know. We'll see what they uh, suggest. I don't have any strong opinions, but it's true that on, on openings I saw they have a bunch of, uh, of good stuff. Oh, this is amazing, actually. So I'm not even sure on which opening I could I could make a course, but you always find a way. Okay, let's see the classical. Maybe on the classical, actually. No, we'll see. We'll discuss. I don't know what are the plans as well. That's always the point, because, uh, of course, you want to... Uh, you don't want to repeat the same course. So I don't know what are their plans. I take here, he cannot take with the queen, I think there is e5 and knight db5, if d5, so uh, he has to take with the pawn, now I go king b1, uh, here I think e5 is strong. The accepted slav in with both colors. Classical Sicilian, Sam already made one, really? Sam, uh, Sam Shankland ma made a course about classical Sicilian, but he's a, he's a machine. He made a course on one d4 on Berlin, I saw already, and also on classical. Okay, so guys, covering everything. 
Um, well, uh, then uh, I will do on something else. I saw the London system was taken by by Le Kuang Liem. That's not good for me. I was hoping to. I thought about London. Many many strong players. Uh, I saw there is many white uh, E4 repertoire as well. West Leso and Ishgiri. Go to chessable.com and uh, of course. You have plenty of you have plenty of great um, videos uh, courses. Lifetime repertoire. Knight c5. Should I go knight c5? Yes, let's go knight c5. Yes, that's true. Sam Shankland is trying to drive Mr. Fresine out of business. Berlin Spanish, semi Slav, and classical Sicilian. And also one d4 as white. Wow. Wow, Sam is a machine. What can I say? Knight if I was stupid, maybe. Oh, I should take now. And I will take here. Whatever happens, actually, bishop b5 might come. Uh, Sam made. Yeah, Sam is Classical and also Berlin. Wow, that's actually amazing. He has a lot of spare time. What can I say? I don't have so much spare time. Should I take on d7? I will take on d7. Hippo, hypo defense. I let this to, to Mr. Trent. Lawrence. All the copy stuff, it's for Mr. Trent. Lawrence. Okay, so I have these three uh, passers, but it's sharp because he has potentially three passers, but I, I think I'm doing better. Hey, échec et mat. Échec et mat means checkmate in French. See, you wanted some uh, French lesson. You get them. Let me go knight d3. I'm protecting the square and I'm attacking here as well. So g5. Let's go. Let's push a bit. We should push at some point. So we want just uh, very simple, very simple stuff. Okay, f6. This is to play e5. I will go a4. I will go b5 next. But yes, are so scary. Uh, scary pass pawns. I just go king b2 and I should be first. Huh. I will go king b3 and b6. Okay. The race. He will play king d7. It's really not clear. Maybe I'm lost. Of king d6. What did I do? Uh, wow, what I did is just incredibly stupid. So I have to go king b4, king b5. King c6 was a big, big, uh, yes, 38 seconds, so I should take him. But he has e2 here, no? Just so lost here, probably. Rook g2, that I like. I will go king a6 now. Who cares about pawns, but it's still, yeah, he has a point, yeah. Uh, rook d1, maybe b7, he will play rook b2. Oof. Rook d1, rook d2, b7. Okay, let's try this, check. Opa. Uh -huh. Ah, now I want to queen. He cannot... Oh, he can. I will play here and here. Oof, that was lucky. Oh, but that's not over, of course. Oh, I'm lost. I'm so lost. This is just amazing. I have to pack the guy. No choice. I will flag you. That's really not uh, the day of glory. Oh, oof, such a bad game. Wow, you, you know, you know so much, uh, Ciel Bleu. I'm always impressed. Okay, that was really a poor game. I'm losing all my rating here. Uh, PN3, let's go. First time we meet. We meet. 
beautiful French victory. So I made a couple of those where I was completely lost. Uh, yeah, no, I'm not playing well, talking too much, I guess. But that's the concept of the show. So that's fine. To entertain. Thank you. Thank you for the game. Hey, Mogdag3. Hi. Yeah, and uh, I didn't... I'm not sure if I mentioned it, but uh, this show on Monday will be a weekly show. So every Monday, of course, most of the Mondays, it won't be every Monday of all the year because sometimes I'm traveling, sometimes I'm doing something else, but most of the Mondays, you will be able to uh, find me here and play Banter Blitz against me. So that's a good news. I hope. Okay, if you don't like it, you don't watch it. I mean, that's very simple. Uh, so I hope it will be a good news for most of you guys. Yeah, you get regular President Banter Blitz on Monday in English. 8.30. And Wednesday, 8.30 as well in French. So at least two a week. Plus, uh, we're waiting for the arenas, so maybe more, more to come. But this is uh, the minimum. That's cool. Thank you, Kanchi Move, who says fantastic news. Yeah, that's nice. That's nice. I'm, I'm, I'm happy, of course. I like, um, uh, how, how to say, I, I like the... Uh, uh, I use, of course, to 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 do um, almost only only French shows, uh, which didn't mean I didn't like to do English shows. But uh, yeah, now I will do much less French shows and much more English shows. So that's how it is. You simply uh, uh, you naturally. Um, have more people watching when it's in English. That's uh, that's how it works. Uh, as simple as that. So that was a decision from Chess24. Hi, Wims Le Tartuffe. How do you think Magnus have fun relaxing camps? We are going to get some food. We talk. There is generally a very good uh, team team atmosphere. So um, it's all good. I think we are enjoying uh, spending time together. This I do. What should I do here? I'm not too sure. Maybe e6. I don't like e6, but okay. I have to I have to play something. Enjoy way too much. Yeah, we did have a nice celebration when uh, when Magnus won the final uh, final game. But I guess this is. Uh, this is understandable and okay. No? What do you think? I think it is. So I remind you that I'm only uh, reading uh, the Chess24 chat, of course, if you are uh, watching us, watching me on Twitch, YouTube, on or Facebook. Thank you very much. But if you want to interact directly with me, in the Chess24 chat, you just have to create um, a Chess24 account. This is very simple. You just need an email. And that's it. You have to verify your account. And that's it. So that it's very simple. So please, uh, I cannot read all the chat at the same time, uh, obviously. So please come and, uh, come and join us. The great Chess24 chat with Ciel Bleu, Wims. Poof. How about that? We have the best here. Queen is seven. I lost my vibe. Ah, I should wait. Ah, knight b5 if I was coming out. Uh, uh, the secret of that's the secret of Sigmund is personal loyalty beyond competence. Thank you very much, Ciel Bleu. You you could say both maybe, uh, loyalty and competence. That would have been um, let's say. Uh, I would prefer, but uh, yeah. Um, 
I see your point. It's very important to have a nice team and nice uh, team spirit. Because then you care. And I think you work better. Um, should I go e5? I will go e5. I want knight d4. Maybe that was stupid because he has knight f3. Then I will have to go rook c5. No, rook d5. Maybe knight c3. A bit of check here. Anyway, he has no time, so I will just flag and take that pawn. Just take that pawn and flag him. Knight d3. Let me go here. Thanks for the game, PN3. Only one point. Wow, that's not much. Allez, the next one. Yup, again. Yup is everywhere, our Spanish friend. Oof, I played so many games against Yup. Let's go for Siciliansky. Siciliansky. Wow, that was amazing. Do you and PH get along? You cannot imagine. Uh, you cannot imagine. Let's go E6 here. Yeah. yeah, we get along well, actually. We, which is a very, very surprising for people I know. I'm going H5. Uh, but actually, <laughs> no, we get along very well. Uh, <laughs> I, know, I know it's not so obvious when you see us on, on camera, but uh, I tell you, I think we do. We'll see in the podcast. Sounds a bit strange. What about, what do you think about Jules Tournaments in Spain last week? It was brilliant. I followed our friend Jules Moussa. French Grandmaster won a bunch of waiting points in Spain. He played some open and he made 8 out of 9, taking one by. So, leaving our Spanish brothers with only one door out of 8 games. He crushed everyone, including Pepe Cuenca, our friend from Chess24, of course, Pepe. Uh, who lost the last round to Jules? So, Guide to Amman by Jules who is uh, clearly, uh, clearly um, making his way up. Yeah. Claude Chiroff who says, Sounds a bit strange that of this. We are the French community, but not allowed to speak French. I don't get the point, honestly. Well, you are, I mean, like, it's better if you don't. If you look, I mean, like, if, if you speak English as you do, Claude Chiroff. And we have to show to people because French are, we are not, uh, people think we cannot speak any languages. So it's nice to show them. And it's nice that everyone can just interact. Um, no, don't you, don't you think? Kruchirov. Okay. I will just castle now. I have this beautiful bishop on this uh, long diagonal. Now queen f6 will come maybe e5, e4, maybe bishop e4. I think I'm better here, but it's of course, uh, it's of course a sh very sharp position. Maybe queen c8 to go queen c6. I think he has to go knight e5, yeah, that's what he did. Maybe I should go queen e8, actually. That was a mistake. Yes, bishop is 7 Maybe yes, bishop is 7 No, I will be able to take queen g6 and rook move. Um, yeah, that's a very, very interesting and very sharp position. H4, okay. Uh, should I go... I don't know. I don't know. I thought I was doing well, but uh, Yup is, is good. Huh? He's good in this. Favorite member of Team Magnus. Magnus? Um, the boss. I have to vote for him. Come on. Okay, I will take and play Bishop C6. But yeah, that's not good. What's going on here? I don't like it. I will have to play f4 at some point. 
Yeah, let me go f4. Bishop f4 will go k5, but he will take. Oh, I'm getting cursed by. Yup. Poof. Okay. I guess I have to do that. I will just go queen g6 now. Maybe queen f7 was more uh, clever. I don't know. Yeah, okay. At least I have a... I'm just saying mate in one here, so... I can take him. Okay, bishop g5, I'll just put another hook here. I have some play. It's not really clear what I'm... Uh, what I'm threatening here, but... Uh, well, anyway, who cares? I should just play faster. And uh, see. Maybe e5, e4, actually. While the time table is coming. That could be a nice... Uh, Nice trick, let me go rook f7 first, why not? And e4 now. If it's blundering, I just take here, I will have ef. And uh, yeah, I take here. Oh, queen e8 was some kind of trouble. It still has queen e8, but I will have queen c2. That's good for me, I think I take him. King h7. Takes, takes. And queen c2 is coming. I will play queen f5 now. I will just mate him on light square. This is very unlucky because it was a very good game from Yup. But now he's uh, just uh, busted. Fully busted. Okay, f2 is also a threat. So, yeah, this is game over. This is mate on the next move. Uh, okay, next. Thank you for the game. Next. Next challenge is Yaes from. Um, what is this? Ah, this is Greek. Okay. So, Kuchi uh, Officing, yeah, he lives in America, even Spanish. Yeah. Yeah, it's better to, to play. Yeah. Thank you. Oof, that's, uh, that's a tr tricky question, Jordan Dubov. That's. If Russian players should be banned from tournaments even if they play under FIDE, it's, it's a very difficult question. I mean, I don't know. I'm, I'm, uh, I've mixed uh, feelings, of course, because, you know, many Russian players, I, I know them personally and I respect them a lot. And it feels incredibly unfair uh, that um, some won't be able to play, that's for sure. I'm not talking here for Kayakin, of course. Uh, <laughs> who deservedly uh, won't be able to play. But, uh, yeah, you know, I mean, um, it feels sad, but you also understand why uh, why these sanctions may come. So, very, very difficult topic. I mean, what can I say? Uh, it's very difficult, huh? you know. Um... It's very sad. Just uh, I, I, all I can say is that um, I hope common sense and peace will prevail as soon as possible. That's all. Um, all I wish, obviously. <laughs> but yeah, obviously. I know that many, many Russian players are the sign a later, which was, which a lot of, you know, it's not easy in Russia to, to sign a, late, a letter uh, talking about war and that uh, peace uh, should prevail and so on. So kudos to them because, um, really, I guess it was, uh, uh, th that could be some uh, consequences for their career. So I have nothing here. I will keep queens after all. Taking that pawn, maybe knight b3 will come. Um, Jordan! 
How about you going premium? And you have a, a great discount. 40% take face. It's for me. I'm paying the 40%. 40% of premium, which if you take a one year subscription, it's seven euros fifty per month. And you have access to all the video series, including the Team Magnus video series. So what 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 are you waiting for? You are playing on your main account. Do you know you're then do both that it's forbidden? To 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 be uh, to have um, multiple accounts. Do you know that it's in the regulation of Chess Twenty Four? Do you know that you're then do both? This is just strictly forbidden. That's not good. That's not good. You lost the password. Come on, you can reset the password. You don't do both. Don't, 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 don't lie. You are a very bad liar. So please, don't, don't do, don't do that. I can teach you a few, few tricks to, to be a better liar. But please, don't do such. A, I mean, you can reset your password. <laughs> I mean, it's such a lie, <laughs> such, such, a, such a weak lie. <laughs> that was really not impressive, Jordan. A uh, high special agent. Oh, please do better. Do better, as they say. You know. Bonne soirée, Laurent. Can I challenge you, Baron Staker? You are a premium member, of course. You are very welcome to challenge me. Please go ahead. I will go Rook F1. Maybe G4 will come. At least I managed to. I misplayed the opening, but uh, now managed to stabilize more or less. I'm a very good liar. Was this blue? I think I, I am actually. Maybe I'm not. But I think I think it's okay. Yeah. You do not pay on this account. You're done. But you, you understand that it's forbidden, yeah? You can change your nickname on the main account. Okay. I can do that for you. If you want, I'm an admin here, so I can. You tell me your new, the nickname you want. So if it's Jordan Dubov, I will change your your nickname. But please stop. Stop doing that. Thank you. Thank you very much. I'm doing like I'm playing table. Oh, it's plus two. Oh boy. I was really expecting this to be a, a three minutes game. Okay, night B3. Now I'm doing well again, I think. Must be not so clear. Anyway, uh, I go here. I will take that pawn. Or maybe with that pawn. I don't know. Accept my challenge, Mario Fatima. It's random, Mario. I'm really sorry, Fatima. It's very random. I cannot do much. I like the randomness. I'll go knight c2, I want knight d4. Maybe I want to take that pawn as well. I don't know. I will... Um, bishop d7, let me take that guy. I'm taking bishop b5, but maybe it's not... Uh, it's not over yet. Uh, queen f6, let me go. Queen d4. Now, queen f7, that feels like a bit too much. Okay, knight c2, and now I'm, I'm stable. I'm stable here, knight d4 will come, and I, I feel uh, I'm, I'm better, that's for sure. How much I don't know. Who cares? Uh, ah, uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. It's so complicated. Chess is such a complicated game. Uh. I don't know. I have absolutely no idea. Let me take that guy. Taking pawns is good. Let's be greedy. Let's be greedy. Let's mate. 
I'll just take here and play rook b1 and wish him very good luck. Good luck, brother. This is just check and take, I think. And this is this will be game over very soon. Peace out. Thank you. Ah, I already had that questions, yeah? That, that question I already had from uh, Rosie's Blue. Uh, unorthodox, did we play? No. Some Indian bother. Hey. Uh, I will go here. So, which same game was the most fun? Thailand or Spain? Both were very, very enjoyable. Of course, we stayed uh, longer in Thailand. We even have... We even had some uh, holidays there. Why? Because Magnus finished the match after only 11 games. And of course, we have we had all booked uh, till uh, the Taywax. So that was nice. The, the, the extra week there was kind of uh, very, very enjoyable. I, I must admit that uh, beach was close uh, and uh, the weather was fantastic. The food is great there. So all was really great in Thailand. I'm, I'm Tim Yan there. I'm I'm also um, quite a big fan of of Thailand. Um, how do a professional chess player planning his chess calendar? Well, very much depends. But in general, you are just planning with uh, the invitations you get. That's as simple as that. So uh, you need time to to play and you need time to prepare. So. General, you see what is important for you, what is not important for you. Just, uh, ah, it very much depends, I guess. Let's say people uh, who are qualified for candidates. <laughs> uh, who qualified for candidates. I am disturbed by uh, Jordan Duboff. Uh, no, no, no. Uh, please, behave yourself. So, chess calendar depends. Let's say uh, people will play candidates. Yeah, I will finish. It's very important for them to, to do well in candidates. So they are all, they are, let's say, uh, making the calendar uh, in a way uh, to prepare candidates, to be fully uh, in, in great shape for candidates. That's how it works. This I can guarantee. Uh, but for the rest, it depends what is important for you. That's as simple as that. Julien D was saying, are there any new French video series in the pipeline? I'm really sorry about that, but no, Julien D. Um, there is less activity in French, unfortunately, but what is good? It's for the, our English community. Uh, the Chess24 English community, there will be more activities. So, you know, you lose some, you win some. That's uh, how life is. But in general, no. Not for the moment. We are not planning any video series in French. While we, we do plan in English, of course. And, of course, you have right now. Uh, I don't think... It, I don't think the, all the episodes of uh, our video series with Jan and Peter about uh, the match, the Magnus uh, Nepo match, was released. But uh, well, you have a nice way to spend uh, ten hours. I hope, at least. Of course, feedback is always very welcome. I didn't know that. Do you know that Thailand is the only country that have never been that has never been invaded? I didn't know that. Bishop d5 is strange because that, that was hanging. So we'll go Queen, Queen f4. So. German broadcasts are also cancelled. I know, Jack Jour. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. I hope uh, we can make a French show. I was kind of uh, promised that. Uh, uh, French will happen for the biggest tournaments, so it means candidates, maybe World Rapid and Blitz, World Championship. But that's about it, I think. 
Ja by som mohol. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. I don't know. Yeah, didn't do both have to leave early to rush after the match? No, everyone was free, of, of course, after the match. I think I stayed like six days. Uh, I think Jordan and Jan didn't change anything to their plans, so they stayed like eight more days. But it was really, I mean, like Minus fi finished the match three games before the end. So it was three days plus uh, two, three day, uh, two, three days plus one day bike. And we were supposed to leave the next the next day, so it was like seven days uh, extra. So I think they stayed the so seven days. I stayed like five days, but Daniel left very very quickly. Like he wanted to go home, which is understandable after spending one month, not one month, but more than twenty days plus in Thailand. No, I don't think he, he gave interview in from Thailand. Yeah, and that was a bit, of course, uh, that was really uh, weak, I would say. This interviews, I mean, like it was the same guys. Huh? It was mainly this bit betraying Russia was Shipov and Kayakin, uh, which, uh, of course, uh, fails to, Im to to impress. Okay, bishop c5, I will attack the knight and the rook. Now I will give a uh, knight e4, maybe I want knight f6, bishop d6. Wow, that's that's good for me. That's very good for me here. I will just go knight f6, attacking the rook. And yeah, that's game over. Now rook d8, I even can go bishop b6, small trick for our friend. Oh, this is on check. And I think, uh, well, I really think I, I'm going to win that game. I will give a check. You cannot challenge many times, Sammy Chela. Aha. Gides, who is telling us 20 days in Thailand, 20 days with Ram. Maybe as well, you know, we get tired at some point, even if the, the great team said, but we may get tired of each other. So the plan now is far from over, but I'm doing a small bike. Like I do in uh, in the French show, five minutes maximum. I'm coming back, and don't worry if you send a challenge, you will have the opportunity to play. Here there's 26 challenges, but don't worry. At some point, I will just switch to uh, to bullet, and then in bullet one minute game, everyone can have a game. So stay here, stay tuned. I come back in uh, something like five minutes. Gides was asking who was cooking. Nobody was cooking. We are going to restaurant every single meal. We were lucky guys. Uh, so stay tuned. I come back in a minute.
And I am back. So, let's go for the next challenge. Aléatoire, still random. Ross Press de Souza. Let's go. On Spanish Amigo. E cuatro. Vamos. Vamos, hombre. Vamos. Vamos. Uh, vamos. Después. Vamos a jugar mañana. Ah, Fatima. Let's go, Fatima. Fatima, we is always a tough challenge. Oof. Okay, I will go with C5. Only C5. Good pressure. Knight C6. Here you have to go C4 as white. Uh, I will play the line with Queen A5. It's a copy line, but Nico Dub, you shouldn't challenge. We played already. Maybe in uh, in bullet you can play later on, but not now. Please. Let the other people play one game. And maybe you have a chance to become premium member with a code. Take first 40. Go ahead. You have a game immediately. In, in bullet it's okay, but later on. Don't worry, Nico Dub will start. We'll start the bullet portion in a bit. So go ahead with Take Face 40, you say 40%. It's for me. Maybe, maybe, maybe I'm overdoing it. I don't know. It's a pawn. It's very difficult to save that pawn. I did too. Now I go, should I go Bishop G4 first to weaken a, a dark square F3? And then I will come back to E6. And I think I'm doing very, very well already. I think she has to play knight d5, which I will take, and now and then play on on dark square. And I am. Um, I think I have a very pleasant position because uh, her pieces are uh, uh, really not uh, developed. So c d now rook f a I don't know. Rook f c a always look a bit more clever than rook. F C is an rook A C eight, but yeah. Uh I don't know, is that position what should I do? Uh I think I should pin. Maybe rook F C eight will come A3, okay. Okay, A3 is nothing. I will just go Queen B6. And oof, that's 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 a decision. Look at that. Look at that. Something will happen, no? Oh, knight takes. That was stupid. I'm still better, probably, but of course, uh, I probably spoiled most of my advantage here. Rook B1, should I go rook C8 and rook C2? Maybe. Knight D7 as well is very tempting. Knight D7 first, maybe. Just to prevent any rook B2 tricks. It feels it feels better for, for black, but uh, of course, um, it's not over. It's far from over. I'm better, that's for sure. Uh, she can play probably rook BC1, Knight D3 maybe. Oh, takes takes knight d3. Yeah, takes takes knight d3. And then I will just take, play rook c8. Maybe I don't have to take. I don't know if I should take or not. Maybe I should take. It looks beautiful to take and then to play rook c8. And I'm, I'm dominant here. I can play bishop h6. Put my bishop here. Rook c3 might come. All his pawns are... Are hanging here. So rook c1. Bishop h6 now. Followed by bishop f4. 
think she has to go f5. Of course, I'm not going to take. I don't want to give any counterplay. And that's just a disaster for, for white. She's trying some, some counterplay here. I will just come with the king. Okay, I'm not sure what this is all about. So a5, five, maybe I'll be one first to make sure that pawn will be hanging. Now I come back. And yeah, that's still uh, very, it's losing simply for, for white. Now I can come with the king. That will be just... Okay, let's let's play with the king. Let's start with the king. The flying king, we call it in French. The flying king. Hoppa! Flying king. Okay, that was stupid, of course. But that's whatever. Now I will, I will correct those guys. I'm so active with the king. Okay, I'm coming back. <laughs> I just... I did it wrong, but yeah, that's okay. Now I've check. Okay, she's doing a flying king to me. Uh, maybe check, take here. It's not so clear anymore. But yeah, she ran out of time. Okay, mock Dak three, French corporate. Hey, Miktal. Let's go. D four knight f six. He has a good rating, Mogdag. I'm not going for, for Budapest this time. Let's see. Oh, Catalan. Wow. Let's give a check. Bishop d2, of course, I can take here. I can take. Okay, let's take and play d5. Let's keep it simple. No, this is not very ambitious for black, but it's very solid. Just go c6, b6, knight bd7, bishop b7, or bishop a6, depending on the on the white setup, and it's kind of okay. Yeah, Mogdag is thinking for long here, but uh, there is no. I mean, you have to play bishop g2, knight f3, and then start to think. Um, maybe he wants to take here, but uh, it wouldn't make a lot of sense. Okay, bishop g2, I just go castle. I'll go c6 next. And see how it goes. Knight f3, okay, I go c6. I can sometimes take here. But this is not my plan, actually. I just want to, to, be, to be solid. That's it. And see what he gets here. He gets, uh, he's thinking a lot, so that's good. It's always good to have a one minute edge on the clock after a few moves. I don't know why he's thinking for so long. I don't know what to do, maybe. Probably. Uh, Queen C2, okay. Anyway, I don't, uh, I can go A5 or so, just take some space, but I will just go B6. And now it's not clear. Uh, I will think for the first time after his next move. To understand if I go bishop a6 or bishop b7. Um, let's go bishop b7. I want c5, rook c8. Something to equalize. Of course, e4 should be very critical here. Uh, e4 is a good move. Yeah. Let me go rook c8. Okay, e5 is e5. I ju just go knight e8. It's no big deal because I, will, I will always have some counterplay on the on the center. H4, of course, is a normal way to go, but it's a very standard position. Oof, C5, I didn't see that. And maybe that's a good move. I don't know. Knight C7, maybe. Or Knight A6, but yeah, maybe F6 and... I'm not sure. Knight a6. What about knight a6? He wants to go knight b3, right? Um, yeah, it's not easy here. Yeah. I can go bc. I'm not sure. Let's go queen e7. Ask him question here. If he wants to take it, it's good for me. Before, of course, before. What I'm doing is as a 
Okay, so let's go. Can I? I'm blundering that pawn. If BC will take DC, my position is cap. Probably have to go F6. You have to go, Nikodub. Okay, see you next time. See you on Wednesday, probably. 6.30. French banter. So, if I take here an IG5. Uh-huh. H6. Ah, that's not a nice move to make, but... Yeah, my position... You played me. It's not forever in the opening, but... It was very well invested uh, this time. I will pre move Queen takes F6. Okay, Bishop H3. He wants uh he wants to kill me in that game. Okay, I will just go rook e8 over protecting on e6. I will again remove queen takes f6. Um, no, I don't like my... I'm sure white is better. I don't know how exactly, but probably there is no need to, to make something very special. I'm playing on time, as always. Ha <laughs> ha, king g2. That feels... That feels a bit too much. It's okay, let me take here. Let me take here. Let me do that. Oof. Wow. What did I do here? <laughs> I should have played knight b5 immediately, of course. Now my pawn is hanging. This is really stupid. Okay. Poof. I need to trick him. He can take with a bishop with check. Can you trade? Oh, I'm still touching knight d4. I'm touching queen f6. That could be actually with uh, a bunch of luck. Not such a bad deal. Can I go rook f3 here? Uh, rook f3. Or oh, queen f6 maybe. Taking here and here. Wow. I think I was very lucky, but it's probably... Oh boy, I missed that. I have knight d4. I'm so lucky in that game if I win. Knight d4, I just take here. I'm too much focused. Should talk more in the chat. I focus too much and I play uh, bad moves. One shouldn't be focused to play blitz games. And this is over a good game. Mock dag. But very bad luck. Julien D. D. French corporate. Let's go. He left. He's not connected. Okay. Nico Dub. No, no, no. He left as well. Julien D again. He had many challenges. Come on. Come on. Okay. Fidel Master Arad Yagag. Lol. Okay, a question from Jordan Dubov. Did Anish Giri? Always like when we start talking about Anish. I like the topic. Help with Ma Team Magnus pre preparation. Of course not. Come on. You should watch the video series. You would have this uh, answer to your question. So no, 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 no. We don't. We we don't take such such help. No need. A three. And okay, I also okay. So bishop c five. Can I go ninety five now and d four? What's the difference between the other version? It's not clear. It's not clear to me. Okay, let's go. Let's go. 
Magnus doesn't play the French, so no need of Anish Gay. Yeah. No, but why was... Ah, so you know, next time maybe. Julien D, I come back. We'll play a game. If you want. Why was Anish Giri in a plane with Magnus to the Spanish camp? He was not coming to the Spanish camp. They were going somewhere else, I think. I don't know where. They were not going to the Spanish camp. They were going to some boat, I think. I think Magnus said something about some... Some two, three days before coming to, to some boat. So no, Anish didn't show up. And now e5. Okay, castle. Should I take or should I? I will just castle. Just for fun. Bishop f6, I will just go f5. Now we'll just take here, no? Aha, uh -huh, he wants knight h4. Okay, I will go d5 then. This bishop is completely killed. Maybe d5 anyway. I may lose my pawn there. So let's go bishop f4 first. The king here, but he has queen b6. Maybe he has a decent position. I just blundered that pawn, which was a bit stupid, obviously. Not in the plan. Maybe queen d3, queen g3. I don't know. Where was he going? I don't know. I'm not following Anish. But not Magnus. But I, what I can tell you is that I, I went to the Spanish camp before Magnus arrived. I think a couple of days before we arrived there. I can guarantee that uh, he was hiding, maybe. Anish was hiding in the Spanish camp. In Cadiz. That was a brilliant. We had a very nice time in, in Cadiz. Not only the place was great, but the people who were there were so friendly. That was really enjoyable. And they were always uh, wishing to 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 help us to to have a nice uh, to have a good time simply. That was really really nice. But Anish maybe was hiding there for ten days, but uh, I didn't see him. So I don't know. So my guess is that he, he he was not there. But never know. Yeah, no, the Spanish camp was brilliant. I mean, like um, it was really, really. We have Queen G3 here. How is he planning to protect here? I don't know. Good luck. He cannot play F6 because now it's pinned. He has to play G6. Poof. Take F7 is hanging. G6 is hanging. This is game over. I will get some writing back. 14 points. Boom. Beren Starker. Sorry if I'm mispronouncing your, your name. 3 plus 2. Are you sure? Yodan Dubov is saying <laughs> keeping Anish Giri locked in a basement is not okay. Hmm. I guess it's not, but it's tempting. Let's face it. It's not okay, no. I I don't... I approve. It's not okay, but it's... <laughs> must be tempting. Okay, I take here... Ah, knight f6. Okay, this is a bit... Um... I don't think this is a move order. Can I go g3 here? And bishop g2. It's not great for white, yeah, this line, but okay. You have to you have to play something. So bishop b4. Okay. I have no clue. Maybe this reason. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Aha, uh -huh. uh, taking make, makes sense. Yeah, actually, I, I was about to say that it doesn't make it was not urgent, but here he's really uh, asking um, tough questions. So I want to attack on b7. Okay, or b8. So he's not afraid of anything. 
bishop f4 it was e5 so it was updated so I'm, i just want e5 queen a5 is nice i missed i can i go b3 and try to tap okay i will try to tap his queen if queen a2 i'm not sure on how to tap the queen ah but i have this queen b1 bishop f4 yes queen b2 I have rook b3 and I'm taking the rook. So I think this is good for, for, for me. Resign. Wow. That's a bit early. Thank you for the game. Moksapop from Germany. Let's go. G6, H4. H4, especially for you. Allez. Ah, no, I should have played h5, of course. That was stupid. Allez. I don't know, but... Uh, oh, this looks nice for me. Now I can develop. Bishop d3, I will threaten to take or to take here sometimes. Knight f3. And uh, yeah, I, I like it. I like it. Have a great initiative. Ninety five, maybe. Let's go ninety five. More questions about Anish Gay, please. Go ahead. Ninety five. Can I go e six and Bishop takes g six? Anish Gay, I think, will play in Oslo. The champion chess tour. This major for some reason, but I, because I don't think he played the previous one. Uh, I think he didn't qualify, but he has a wild card. Vanya Land waiting patiently. I'm really sorry about that. Oof, now I'm collecting the, the bishop. That's not good. That's not good. Thank you for the game. I will be here every. Monday, 8.30. So even if you cannot play today, but after that game against our uh, friend from Mexico, I was not 100% sure. We'll play some... Um, we'll play some bullet. So please, challenge me in one minute game. And I will play all of you and... Some of you will win against me. I can tell, I can guarantee that. I don't think I lost a game tonight, which is good. I meant a few doors, but I didn't lose. But in the bullet portion, in general, I'm, I'm losing. Is this major in place of the Magnus Carlsen Invitational? Not at all. This is just a, a tournament from the Champion Chess Tour, Jordan Dubo. It feels weird to... to to have a nickname Jordan Dubov. This is just uh, yeah. It's funny, but it feels it feels very weird. Let's face it. C five is if he's going a five, I just take here. This is three minutes game. So I should be fast. Did Magnus block Anish Twitter on gear on Twitter? I don't know. Actually, I don't know. It's it's not impossible. Um, I, I actually I don't know. Oof, Mister Fresine, what is your workout routine? I'm um. So that's a very embarrassing question. Very much depends. I mean, because I'm doing different activities, so. My main activities are not about uh, playing chess. I played last week in Bundesliga. That was a disaster. But um, I didn't play the last 10 months. So the main uh, thing for me is uh, streaming and uh, being a trainer. So ah, it very much depends. Yeah, of course, uh, when there is a World Championship coming up, 
uh, you can imagine that it's very different from a normal normal day. So I don't have any any routine. Or when I'm doing commentaries, I used to do a lot of commentaries in French. Of course, uh, then uh, it's uh, completely different. So there is no so-called routine. What do you train? I don't train anything, Gides. Ah, who do you train? Ah. I I'm 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 in the team of uh, world champion. That's a lot of work, Gides. Would you ever consider lifting weights? No, I don't, but I'm playing uh I like I like to play with a racket and a ball. So I like tennis, I like badminton. You put basically you give me a racket and a ball and I'm happy. Um Quincy two can I play Quincy three? I have this uh, habit to, to go for the end game on knight c3 and rook a2. It's too sharp. No, I never played go, Vanilla Land. I'm a card player. I like to play cards. All kind of stupid games. I'm ready. But I never played go. Okay, Queen b1 is surprising. Aha, this is um this is not increment, yeah? So I should go maybe rook d8 and protect my pawn, even if it's a bit sad. It doesn't feel like a good move, but it's at least uh, very solid. So now I will come back and set a knight c3 back. Bishop d3. This is the... Fuck! How we call it? I can even go here. Saying ok one. Oh, we didn't see okay one, and this is game over. This is game over for our friend Rubjan. Texas Hold'em, yeah, I played quite a lot. Texas Hold'em, yeah. Okay, let's go for the one minute game. Did you challenge me, guys? Ah, two plus three with Julian D, who got his game aborted. So let's see, two plus three is funny. Let's go. And then we'll go one minute. New interview with Magnus says Magnus will not defend his title again. When? When was that, Jordan Dubov? What will Team Magnus do? Very simple. We do a, post a podcast, the Chicken Chess Club. Very simple. We walked in off. Too much. Too many matches. No, I don't know. Let's see. He said that uh, if it's not Aliyah's eye, he doesn't see a, a great challenge. But, uh, well, let's see Aliyah's eye. First of all, I think Aliyah's has very good chances to win the, um, uh, the candidates. And then, if he, if Aliyah's doesn't win, then let Magnus decide. He can still change his mind. Or see uh, who is his opponent. I don't know. It's a new interview. Okay. Okay. Then it's a bad news for chess, I guess. Of course, it's Magnus' decision. He's playing its stuff. We all know it's stuff. Oh, that's weird. What he's doing? Um, yeah, it's uh, but it's his decision, of course. What can I say? Uh, but as long as you know, you decide not to play the match when you, you when there's a contract offered, and uh, you decline. As long as it it is interviews and so on, the, the I mean the, the decision is not final. 
So let's see. It's a different thing to to give an interview about that and to not to sign the contract and to to lose your world champion title. So we'll see. It's not clear to me. Okay, ninety six. Oh, that's weird. Okay, let's go before. It says Magnus Carlsen feels even more unlikely to defend his world title. Okay, more unlikely. More unlikely is not never. There's a difference. So that's already. Uh, you didn't do both. You were like uh, overdoing it. There is no decision yet. We will see. We will see. I think it's. Um, I understand. I understand is. Oh man, I understand. I was never uh, even close to playing a match, so I, it's difficult to understand. But there is a lot of pressure, and it doesn't feel that the challenge is very interesting if he's playing Nepo or someone like that. But if he's playing Alieza, it's. I mean, you cannot say it's not an interesting challenge. First of all, the guy is. Uh, French. Then he's uh, 30 in, uh, 13 years younger. And okay, he's up and coming, you know, like, uh, I mean, Aliaza, who can say that he's not impressed by Aliaza? I mean, he's a, just a monster. <laughs> he will play if Ikao qualifies. That would be uh, fun, yeah? Uh, 10 years later, that Ikao qualifies. <laughs> that would be funny actually. Uh I don't think its chances are great, but uh, who knows? I didn't think its chances were great in the Grand Prix. So come on, I still an interesting challenge too. I would think so, but on the other hand, Ciel Bleu, it's more than ten years that Magnus uh, is proving that he's better than Kawana. I mean like more than ten years. I mean ten years is quite it's quite a lot of time. I will pre-move, mate. Okay, thank you, Julien. Now I will only take one minute. Uh, we only play one minute. So I will delete all the challenges which are not one minute. Hop. Hop. One minute. Hop. Hop. Hot Danone. Hop, hop, hop. One minute. And we go. Here we go, please. Even if you played already against me, you can play another one in one minute. Uh, okay, let's go here, here, here. So you see, I'm not, I'm not too fast in um, in bullet, but yeah, you need to be uh, simply not too bad and not too slow, not too weak and too slow. If it reminds uh, something to people, if you are not too weak and too slow. Then uh, you have good chances to win against me. Okay. And now I have a great end game if he's taking here. Oof. What did I do? I go queen a5 now. Oh, but maybe you can take on d6. And I can go d8. Oh, that's good news. I'm doing very well here. And now, hop up, check, check, and pre move here. I will take that guy and have a winning end game. Careful, careful. I saw it. Ah. I don't know what this is about. Uh, okay, this is not great. I have to play a bit faster, please. A bit faster. Okay, a little check. Check. Here. It's game over. This is game over. This is game over, brother. This is just over. Hoppa. Let's have fun. 
uh, here. How do I mate? I'm not sure. I'm, ma I'm mating. If I'm not mating, that was the most stupid. I'm mating, probably. Blue Bomb. There is many German supporters of Blue Bomb. Oh, the current European champion, of course, very, very uh, promising young German player. Max Pop, let's go. Uh, yeah. Okay, let's go here, here. Ah, uh -huh, I didn't expect the rat. The rat to happen. Can I go? Ah, I'm taking the pawn. But in a bullet game, it's not so stupid what he did. I'll just take here. 96 first, maybe. Takes, takes. And here. And game. I'm pretty slow, but... Uh, and weak, of course, as you know. But... Should be fine. Hopefully. Let me take that guy. Take hook the eight. Um, he's faster than me, huh? I should be careful with the guy. Pawn is falling. Hop. Ah, that was a bit opa. We have time to finish the game. Okay, let me push that guy. Push. Push! Aha, too late! I don't have pre move queen. No, that one I'm going to win. That one I'm going to win! So happy birthday to Matthias Bluebomb! Bluebomb! How old is he? 24? 5? 23? 2? I have no idea. Traceable rec recommends. Wow, the latest course of untraceable recommends. E4, E5, Knight F6, Knight F6, Knight C5, Knight C4. Wow, amazing. Allez. Papter. Let's go, Papter. He disconnected. No, he's here. Ah. Oh. Ah. Wow, playing for tricks. Right from the start. Oh boy. I'm so... Okay. But this is not great compensation, I would say. Okay. I will take, play bishop g5 and keep it safe. As always! h6, bishop h4. Okay, this pawn is just... Uh, I want to go c1, but yes, rook fc8, I can go. I will go knight d5 and c4. And how much uh, can I go? I don't want to exchange. Oof, that was stupid. Of course. Uh, let me go here. Not blunder the pawn uh, twice in a row. Let's go b3. Uh, I will go knight g4 now. And it's a solid pawn up. He has no compensations. But, but nothing actually. It's just busted, busted for good. Allez, 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 allez. And Rizainito. Thank you, a team Razor. And see you next time. Next Monday if you want. Or Wednesday if you speak French. Or even if you don't. If you become a player member, you can challenge me. Take friends 40. Go ahead. Monkey King. From China. Budapest. Check. Uh huh. This is good for me, I think. Ah, uh, yeah. This is a good Nimzo. This is supposed to be a good Nimzo, but who knows? 
we'll just go here move f3 i like e4 i just do e4 without without thinking even i will just go here oh that's a disaster for for white obviously i mean the end game is just completely lost i don't even take that pawn i will i will take that one i take whatever i want here it's just too easy too easy for black Cook fd1 i even have bishop e2 the other way around of course i could take that pawn but this is an exchange and this is resignable for our friend monkey takes i will take here and it's game over i would think uh a6 97 i would okay seven i think oh ho 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 and yeah i'm taking the knight i have 30 seconds should be should be an easy win thank you Allez, Sispal from uh, Greece again. Great, let's go. Allez, so this King's Gambit. Uh -huh, you didn't expect it, yeah? You didn't expect it at all. I will play Castle now. Have a great King King's Gambit. I would. Uh, I'm feeling. I will play Knight C3. Just to get rid of this uh, very annoying knight here. And now we go. We go for the attack. Uh, queen in one. I want queen g3, bishop g5 maybe. Uh, queen g3. Thank you, Jordan Dubov. Thinking I'm very nice and the games are pleasant. I'm trying to. Oof. King's Gambit. That was a nice spawn. On f7. Because now everything is falling. Bishop g5 also coming. Bishop h6. I don't care a bit. And I'm winning everything in bullet. Guys, come on. Step up your game. Vanya Land. One minute. From where? What is this flag about? I have no clue from where is this flag. Uganda. Oh, sorry. Wow, that's nice. I'm taking here. I didn't know the flag, to be honest. I hope you forgive me. I will go d5. c5. Boom. Ah, maybe not. Maybe no boom. But yeah, I'm still okay. I c6. I will just go bishop e6. I can have some nice pawns here. Uh, this would be funny. But no, no, no. This didn't happen. So let me go b5. Check and take. And now we'll push our pawn majority. Okay, that is only a check. Uh huh. That is funny. I, at least, I think it's funny. Okay, let me push. Let me... I can have... Oh. <laughs> it's too tempting, come on! <laughs> it's way too tempting, I have to do that. I will go king f8. Oh boy, I didn't see that. My time is not great. My time is really not great. Okay, now let me go here. I never pre-move bother, so you, you, there is no no point. Oh, she's check. Fuck. Sorry. Oh boy, what I'm doing? Oh. Boy, ah, some time. GG. Is it on time? What can I do?
Allez. A few more games from Brazil. I love that. To be honest, it's what I love about chess. You can play uh, one guy from Uganda, then the next one from Greece, then Brazil, and we are one and uh, one community. How uh, it's uh, really it feels good. It's like in the Olympiad. It's what I uh, why I love. I always loved uh, chess Olympiad because you see you see people coming from all all over the world and it's one family. It's, it's what's it's really great about chess. You know it's. Uh, really fantastic. So here you see it. I mean, it's fantastic. So come, come guys, come on Wednesdays. I'm doing it in French. You can brush up your French and play because I'm playing against everyone randomly. So you can even be late and be lucky. You know, that's how it works. Just to annoy our friend who wanted. Uh, to be like the first to arrive, to be fair. What is fairness? Come on, come on. Let's be serious. Two seconds, yeah. Now I'm winning. I think take. Yeah, it's just pawn up. Oh no, bishop a3 was missed. I think. Uh, I can go bishop e4 if I want to. Bishop b7, okay, okay. But the point that I'm playing faster than him, well, that's uh, bad news for him. Uh, because uh, that's a way to win against me, to play fast. Let's see if I have a good move here. So, um, here, I will go here. There is no no reason to, to worry here he as, uh, as white. Take both the pawn. g7, bishop d4, bishop b3. Whatever, whatever works. Yeah. Thank you for the game. Okay, Syrian, let's go. Gensuna Sumus, yes, Jordan. Great. Bravo. Okay. Okay. Some Kings Indian. Some small provocation, which, uh, he, he pretends that he didn't see it. Okay, we'll go d6. And yeah, well, 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 well. just uh, a boring position. What can I say? Um, not much uh, happened here. Okay, I can go here. Maybe I want this, but f4 would be always a problem. So let me play on dark square here. What was, what was this about? But okay. Queen b3, I will go b4. Um, yeah, let me take here. Here. Here, here. Uh, take. Ah, I'm not doing well. Oof. Don't like what I'm doing here. I want some chipo. Chipo on G4. Uh, chipo here. Oh boy. What does he want? I have no clue. An ID6. Okay. Night G4 is coming. Night G4 is coming. Allez. Allez. Allez, he wants rook e8. Oh boy, check. Uh, check here. No, no check. And now, well now, what should I do? I don't know. Check. Flying king against me. Come on. Come on. Yes. That was that was close. Mogdak three as the Olympiads or other national team events still a personal goal for you. I don't think so, Mogdak. No, 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 no. Those days are gone. Fortunately, it was nice, but 
Okay, why must lose with Boggs? I already played against him, but uh, yeah, I will take the last four then. And uh, we'll uh, call it a day. Is that okay? So everybody who challenged, not everybody, because uh, but most of the people got a game to play, which is nice, I think. I have three. Ooh, it's a bit slow. Yeah, I was, I was very lucky. Syrian 77 says maybe thank you. I don't know. I cannot read that, but uh, I guess it was nice. Hope so. Ali, this is supposed to be a good French. I'm going here, 92, maybe F5. Maybe Queen F2. Yeah, this I take the pawn, 92 will come. Okay, that is G4, F5. Is on the agenda. Mm, allez. 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 Uh -huh. I like this bishop is really, it's really, really, um, bishop b5. I thought I didn't see, but I will exchange queens and give a check. Why, why I came here? That was... Why did I do that? Okay, I will play for Chipo. Okay, Chipo. Chipolito! Chipolito worked! Chipolito! We have to be faster! It's over. Thank you! So the last four, as I said, hot Danon. Let's go. I played him in my last banter. Takes takes, knight f6, knight c3. Opa. Oof, this is a dragon in bullets. This is weird, but okay. How it is. Just go king b1. Knight d4, I want e5. I hope he doesn't know that line, but... So of course, uh, so of course, of course, of course, uh, serious gamble. Bishop c5 attacking here. I think he has to play d4. As far as I remember, but I'm not, I'm not too sure. Bishop e6 might be played. Bishop c4 is, uh, I will play bishop f2. And yeah, I'm not too sure. Okay, now I go bishop b5. I win a tempo on that hook. Maybe I should have played bishop b5 actually. Why well, didn't play bishop b5? That was really stupid. Okay, let me take here. And uh, well, I'm better on on the board and on the clock, which is in general a good idea. Okay, that is game over basically. Queen b3, I will just go okay one and. That's fine. Jordan Dubov, thank you for the entertainment. Thank you. Thank you, Jordan. That was nice to come. A nice nickname, even if you cannot use multiple accounts. That's not legal. Oof, I have to hurry up. But yeah, that's enough. Okay, that's three. And we call it tonight. Ah. Uh -huh. Uh, thank you, Mogdag. Okay, I will go for the Budapest. Opa! Jumping! This is a good opening in bullet. All is very confusing. I will go knight c5, if g3, I will go h5. Let's see if he saw my game with Nicodub. He probably didn't. But yeah, it's not like I'm winning here, but uh, I massively was, that's for sure, before. Oh. Okay, Bishop G7 showing some uh, some talent. Hopefully. At least I'm playing fast. That's pleasant. Mm. 
and now we'll go bishop b6, bishop b7, yeah? What else? Okay, that's not a big issue. Can play with d1, so. Now that. I'm not sure, yeah. Not sure of what's going on, but that's the point of uh, of bullet. I'll go here. Uh huh. Should be careful. Bishop c4 is a good move. My pawn is a bit. Uh, my pawn is a bit weak. On d4. Okay, e5. I have a pop. Okay, I will come back here. Oh, oh, that's not good what I'm doing. He's, play, he's outplaying me. Why, why he has no time? And also a uh, worse position. Thank you. I flagged him. That's good. Monty24. Allez. From... Uh, from quite, uh, Singapore. Sorry, 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 sorry. Oof, the flag... I'm more tricky than uh, <laughs> when I'm doing uh, banter in French. Of course, it's mainly French flag, so that's simple. But here, it comes from all over the world. Just take here. Is 94 working? No, I don't think so. Uh, okay, let me go H4. Maybe I should have taken first, but yeah, it doesn't really matter. Uh, okay, he knows this. He knows what he's doing here. I think he's playing like someone who knows what he's doing. But never trust anyone in chess. Neons, yeah. Well, that looks not great for me, but okay. I have to keep going. What else can I do? F4 is coming. Uh, what should I do here? I'll take and take. Okay. G4 maybe. Oof, that sounds like a, like a mistake. But I don't know. Allez. Oof, that's promising for me. I believe. Bishop C6. That was missed. That was massive, massive miss for Monty24. He's still playing. Come on. Resign. Resign. What is this? Opa. Last one against Oops Kitty. Let's go, Oops Kitty. He's changed his flag. Come on, you change your flag. For me, it's like Vatican City State. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> Come on. Oops, Kitty. We know. We know you. Don't mock us. Don't mock us. Please. If a pawn, oh, that's not a good. I don't like this king's ambit when uh, I don't want to be a pawn up. I want to be a pawn down to to have some uh, to have some play. It's not why you play the, the king's gambit. Oh, oh. My position is a disaster. Just a disaster. I mean, come on. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. I'm getting crushed by some guy from Vatican who is mocking us, obviously. Um, yeah, that's, 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 uh, two points, but, yeah, okay, I have to take, hope for the best. I'm so busted here. Uh, let me do that. I have to flag him. Can you imagine? Oops, G3, yeah, if I take here. Okay, I do that. Okay, 
just blundered so badly. And that? What about that? I won't check in ninety five. He's going to miss it. Check. That was a lucky move. Boom! Thank you. Thank you for the game. Thank you for watching me. I hope you enjoyed this session of uh, Bunker Blitz, which um, will become a weekly Bunter Blitz in English every Monday, 8.30. So please uh, join uh, the show if you liked it. Of course, there is as well every Wednesday at 8.30, except this week it will be 6.30. Uh, it's a special o o occasion, so 6.30 on Wednesday, you can join me, join me for the Banter Blitz in French. Thank you very much. Have a great evening. Bye-bye.